متكئين فيها على Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel, The Performance Today. Once again, I'm here with an amazing message, amazing recommendation from my subscribers. I'll be listening to and reacting to a video titled Surah Isa, Emotional Quran by Omar Ishe, all Arabic. Wow. And believe me, I'm not a, I'm not a Muslim. I'm a Christian, but I believe one thing is peculiar to all religion. One thing is peculiar to both Christianity and Islam, and that is the message of peace, the message of love, the message of forgiveness. I believe we can learn from each other. The Muslims can learn from the Christian. The Christian can also learn from the Muslim. So we can make better decisions. There's no need to eat ourselves. I believe if we can learn from each other, if the Muslim can learn from the Christian, if the Christian can learn from the Muslim, we will know better about this religion that have been presented to us and it will help us make a better decision. So because of that, I'll be reacting to this Muslim video. Let's start with the video. هل أتى على الإنسان حين من الدهر لم يكن شيئا مذكورا إنا خلقنا الإنسان من نطفة أمشاد نبتيه فجعلناه سميعا بصيرا So 
يسمى سلسبيلا ويقوف عليهم ولدان مخلدون إذا رأيتهم حسبتهم لؤلؤا منثورا وإذا رأيت ثم رأيت نعيما وملكا كبيرا عاليهم ثياب سندس خضر واستبرق وحلوا اساور من فضه وسقاهم ربهم شرابا طهورا Quran recitation, believe me, what is actually reciting or saying is exactly the truth. Just like I said at the beginning of the video, one thing is peculiar to both Christianity and Islam, and that is the message of truth, the message of love, the message of forgiveness. Wow. And before now, before I start watching YouTube video on about the Quran, about the Islam religion, I never knew that the is the Muslim that the Islam religion is also similar to the Christian religion. It was when I started watching some videos on YouTube about the Quran, about the Muslim, about Islam. I got to know that Islam is also similar to Christianity, though we have our little little differences. But if you look at it. In the way Islam and Christianity, they are similar. And I know, just like I said, one thing is peculiar to both religions. And that is the message of peace, the message of love, the message of forgiveness. Same thing he has recited. I believe this similar thing is also in the Bible. And we all, we have come to this earth. We have come to this earth as a test. And we one day we all will be called to give account of 
account on how we have lived our life on this planet Earth. And believe me, that's why the Bible encourages us, the Quran encourages us, also the Bible also encourages us for us to live a righteous life. Because when we'll be called to give account and judgment will be passed, it's either you make heaven or you make hell. And believe me, hell is not a good place to be. So that's the reason why we all, we have to live a righteous life. I believe there's only one reason to which we were created. There's only one reason to which we were created. Be a Muslim, be a Christian. There's only one reason we are created. And that reason is to be able to serve God in truth and in spirit. That's the only reason why we are created. Though, you know, most of us, I'm not saying most of us, you know, what we see right now in the world, you see a lot of people engaging in all sorts of things, drinking, smoking, doing all sorts of things that does not glorify the name of Allah, that does not glorify the name of God, because they believe that is what the that that they, they believe that if you are able to do all those things that you will end up living a life that will be enjoyable for you but I, i'm telling you that there is just like what i've heard from the recitation there is more to life and we all have been created for a purpose and that one purpose is to be able to serve allah is to be able to serve god so i believe there is a need for us to be able to live a righteous life, for us to be able to live a faithful life. Because there will come a time when the trumpet will sound and we all will give account on how we have lived our life on this earth. Just like I've said, we are here as a test. And the only way we can be able to pass this test is to live a righteous life. So one day, when we are called to give account on how we have spent our life, we will be among those ones that will make heaven and not hell. Because believe me, hell is not a good place to be. So there's a need for us to be able to serve God in truth and in spirit, for us to be able to committed to, for us to be able to be committed to God, for us to be able to serve Him diligently. So I believe that is the reason why we are created. That is what He expects from us. Wow, you can tell this Quran recitation is really very emotional. You can tell it's really very emotional. And there's a need for us to be able to follow, for us to be able to follow the Quran, for us to be able to follow the Bible. That's why I'm also doing this reaction. That's why I'm watching this video because there is a need for us that we are Muslim to learn from the Christian. There's a need for us that we are Christian to learn from the Muslim. Because this religion has been presented to us. Even even most of us from birth who have been born into a Christian home, from birth who have been born into a Muslim home, and we just follow the path of the religion. But I believe as time goes on, as we begin to grow, there's a need for us to be able to make our decision. And the only way we can make our decision and stand by our words is when you get a better understanding of the true religion, when you get a better understanding of Christianity, a better understanding of Islam, I believe with this understanding, you can make a better decision for yourself and decided uh, with this understanding, you can make better decisions for yourself and hold your ground on whichever religion you want to belong. So, I really enjoy this recitation from the beginning down through to the end. So, I would like to hear your comments. What do you like about this recitation and which other Muslim video, Muslim recitation, which other video would you love me to also listen to and react to? Don't forget, click on the subscribe button, click on the like button. Do have a nice day. Love you. Bye.